another day, another 5 a.m. workout. Today is Thursday, October 24th. And today I'm gonna have a long day, so I'm like, let's get this chop chop, let's get it over with. But I actually scheduled this before I even knew that I was gonna have a busy day today because my friend um, was gonna do the 5 a.m. body pump workout, which is what we did the other day before she goes to work. So I was like, you know what? I understand the 5 a.m. workouts now. So let's go. Let's get it, let's go. And plus today is gonna be a long day because um, like around one, I'm gonna leave the house because my sister invited me to a Celtics game today because she had extra tickets. So we out. I'm excited. I've never been to a basketball game before. And for those of you who have been watching for a while, I'm not really like a sports fan, but you can't say no to a like game, to a basketball game at that. So I'm excited. She has like a hoodie that um, that I'm gonna wear today. And yeah, I'm just excited. I'm also excited because it's in Washington DC. So yeah, it's gonna be a long day because we're driving back the same day. So yeah, anyways, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Thank you guys so much for waking me up today. Thank you so much for giving me another day on this beautiful earth and for everybody watching right now. Thank you so much for waking up my family, even though right now they're sleeping, but I heard all of them snoring. Thank you so much for always protecting us and for giving us a roof over our heads, for giving me this car to drive to the gym, for giving me the funds to go to the gym and the strength to go as well. And just thank you for everything, amen. Truly grateful, truly blessed. Let's go. Okay, we in here. Say I'm good hearted, but I'm just getting started. Oh my, it's on the target.
And just like that, my workout is done. Like I said, I totally understand why people do early workouts. Honestly, like the, the other day when my friend told me about it, like I was gonna go anyways because she's such like a good friend, you know? And I'm like, if I'm gonna do a 5 a.m. workout, I'm gonna do it with her. Like she's just really supportive, really motivating. I'm about to take a picture. Or a screenshot of my I should say boomerang so yes yeah, so, but still like I was like damn 5 a.m. like I gotta wake up at 4 or something and then um this is my second time doing it oh shit, I gotta get to the kids this is my second time doing it and it feels really good like I get to go home get the kids ready shower and then um, I'm gonna try to work. I don't know how much footage I have for, for today's vlog that's gonna go up, but regardless, I'm gonna try to work. And then if I'm if I want to take a nap, I'm gonna take a nap because, like I said, today we have the Celtics, Celtics game, and we're leaving like around like 1:30 ish. So yeah, like I already got my workout done. I don't gotta worry about that. And I was just telling my friend, I'm like, even though we've done this only twice, like this class. I mean, I've done the class already. This is my fourth time, but it's my second time doing it at five o'clock so i was telling her i'm like I, I did legs yesterday and i still felt like so good doing the squats and the well the lunges towards the end that shit was horrible even on regular leg day where i can like stop and all of that stuff lunges suck so definitely stopped a few times a day but with the squats and stuff in the beginning i'm like damn i feel a little stronger it was really like it was hard but it wasn't really hard you know like i feel like i'm just gonna get it gonna get stronger <sighs> anyways i feel good i feel good and oh so anybody out there who has like a gym if you're like signed up to a gym and y'all have classes i totally recommend the 5 a.m class especially if you be having a busy day whether you work a nine to five or if you're a stay-at-home mom y'all know being at home is a mother effing job so it's better to just knock it out before the kids wake up and then you have the whole day ahead of you and you don't have to like be like oh i gotta work out today you know you already got it done totally totally get 5 a.m people now i totally get it makes sense you know how people say like the most successful people usually wake up like at three to five o'clock in the morning i totally understand like you can get so much done throughout the day and if once again you want to take like an hour or two nap you could get it done and you still wake up and it's still early okay let me stop loving okay about to drop pookie off and then come back home i was just posting some videos on Instagram. Pookie's about to get in the car. Are you always going home alone? No, she's with Papa. Oh yeah, I forgot. We about to be out. Oh my it's god, a, my stomach hurts and I gotta use the bathroom. It's a 55 year anniversary. 55 year anniversary not 55 and a uh, 50 year university you say year university trick chain go what are you doing you got there first i hope you have a good day oh, there's a bus door right there mm. he barks he barks yes like yells 
blow okay boards like more far yeah oh okay love you puppy give me a kiss Hold on. you give me a kiss thank you love you have a good day you too. thank you see you later half full career bye pookie pookie i might not see you till tomorrow morning because i'm gonna come home really late today don't look at me like that. I'll see you later. I love you. He went like that. Protect my babies in school, God. Please, like you always do. Amen. Oh, my goodness gracious. What's up, everybody? I am doing my hair. This is what I'm doing, too. I'm just putting curls in it, but... Oh, maybe I should use... You know what, that's going to take too long. She hadn't sent me like a curling iron and I would use that right now, but my sister's going to pick me up in like 10 minutes and I feel like that's going to take forever. So I'm just curling it with my iron. Um, and I, like I mentioned, I'm going to a Celtics game. My sister has like a, a Celtics hoodie for me. So I'm just, I just have on this tank top that I'm going to have underneath. And I'm going to call it a day, okay? And I just saw on SZA's account, for those of you who don't know, I love me some SZA. I love me some Summer Walker. They're like my two faves. And her and Kiki Palmer have a movie coming out. And it looks funny. So I'm excited to watch it because I'm definitely going to see that. Seems like she's good at acting too. She seems really silly in that movie. But yeah, so uh, I guess you guys will see me on my way to... DC, I need to like have a little staycation because they dicey. What the hell? DC is only three hours away, and I heard that DC is popping, so I would love to go and just have like a little, like a weekend little staycation over there one day. If you guys are from the DMV area, DC area, let me know one, what area is good to stay in. And two, some good restaurants out there. Specifically seafood. But you know, any any other restaurant is cool. I would love to go soon. Anyways, let me stop blabbing and finish doing my hair. Okay, I put some um, eyeshadow, but I'm kind of not liking it. <laughs> Anyways, I'm in my sister's closet right now. Bruh. Anyways, I need a closet like this. I'm looking for her Celtics. Oh, I kind of want to wear this one, but I don't think that will fit me, actually. I think, oh, this is it right here. This one's a large. Let me put y'all somewhere. Right here. Okay. Y'all, and I need to get a fucking charger because oh, this is no, bro. I feel bad popping it. Let me make sure this is it. Yep, this is it. Um, I feel, what was I gonna say? Oh, I need to get a charger because girl, I need to have battery. Hi, Coco's. <laughs> we just got here, so she's just like, wants love right now. Oh, I kind of want to wear this hat. Can I? Does it match? Is it too much? You know what I just noticed? I am going to take it off a little bit, but I just noticed that it does look funny because I don't have any eyeliner and I forgot that I brought the eyeliner. Um, and I was going to put it, and I was going to put it when I got here, but I left it in the car. If I should have it like this, or if I should just put my shades up here, which one is cuter? I don't know if I should wear these, or if I should put on these. I think I'm going to wear these. I'm going to ask my sister because these are her sneakers. Let's see. I don't know. I don't know what vibes I like. Oh, 
Okay. I figured if you was popping out, I was like, this nigga's on the What if that happens on the Dad, the way he said it too, he mad fake, bro. Whoa! <laughs> We'll go! <laughs> and, you, and you gotta put your hands on your hips. <laughs> We'll go! <laughs> We'll go! Bro, I cannot believe that. Keep right toward Capitol Hill.
Winners! I was just looking at the food at the game. What? the Lakers! Oh, whoa, whoa. Bro, I put it up for a reason. This is the conspiracy! It wasn't a fucking plane. I'm just joking, it was a plane. I believe y'all. <laughs> Tell me that you're my baby. Oh, it's a good look, baby. Me is what I call life. Cool. What kind of love in the bedroom door? So for you, this is just a good time. But for me, this is what I do. I miss you when I kiss you. Oh, I'm mad I live for Alrighty, you guys so that's the end of today's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it yesterday was a long day right now i'm trying my best to finish this video and edit and all of that because i'm gonna go straight to my sister's house and i'm gonna help her with her halloween party tomorrow but yeah definitely had an amazing time at the celtics game definitely better than baseball games just fyi i would 100 percent go back to a basketball game i feel like it's better in person than it is on tv because whenever people are watching basketball i'm just like this but in person it was awesome and then also the guy cast of love is blind was there i saw later on that they went because for those of you who don't know it was based in washington dc so yeah they were there but they were on the other side and i didn't notice until later not that i would have done anything anyways but it was just interesting anyways i love you guys and like i always say surround yourself with people who make you laugh and a hundred thousand million percent do not drain you and confuse you life is too short for that draining feeling and it's the worst Surround yourself with people that make you laugh and make you happy. And you guys will see me later. Peace out.